Shalom everyone, this is Varsha and today we are going to meditate on the word of God. So Luke chapter number 8 and verse number 43. And a woman was there who had been subjected to bleeding for 12 years, but no one could heal her. She came up behind him and touched the edge of his cloak and immediately her bleeding stopped. As we look into the scripture, here the woman touched Jesus, not the other way around. Because as we look into the uh, scriptures of the Bible, there are many times when Jesus touched the one who needs the healing. Every time Jesus went into the crowd, people asked for his touch. They asked him to touch them so that they could be healed. But here the faith of the woman is in such a way that she touched the Jesus and received the healing from him. There are two different ways. Jesus touching us is different from we touching Jesus. The woman here touched Jesus with the faith that she had. But we as believers are unable to put that faith in Jesus. We are unable to put the faith that if I touch him, I am going to be healed. But how come this woman has touched him and received the healing instantly? When we meditate on this word, people in those days used to consider the one who are sick as an unclean one. So she was unclean for 12 years. No one had ever touched her for 12 years. She was in the suffering. In that suffering, she got a faith that if I touch Jesus, I'm going to be healed. So we as a believers are go through a lot of sufferings, but we never realize that our faith is an, in our sufferings. When we look into the Luke chapter number 6 and verse number 19, and the people all try to touch him because power was coming from him and healing them all. So the woman here has touched Jesus and received the power from Jesus, received the healing from Jesus. The same way as she has started the faith, the faith continued for the generations. The suffering that she was going through has unlocked the dimensions of the faith which we have never seen before. When we see in the Bible, all the scriptures say that Jesus has touched him and healed him. But here we see that woman has touched Jesus and received the healing. Which dimen this dimension of faith has been followed by the generations to come. So we might think that we are going through a lot of suffering, but uh, according to the word of God, we can unlock the dimensions of the faith through our sufferings. As this woman who suffered a lot for like 12 years has unlocked the, her unique dimension of faith, let us all endure the suffering and unlock our unique dimensions of faith and worship Jesus. I hope you all understood the word. Uh, shalom.